Welcome back to Noah's Awakening, beautiful souls of planet Earth. I wanted to bring another video about expectations and attachment. About it's how the ego can hold on to expectations, whether, like I said, you know, whether we set for ourselves or for other people. I've made a video on expectations in the past. And expectations are what lead us to one of the main sources that lead us to attachment in my opinion and non-attachment is one of the biggest fundamentals for spiritual growth you know we become so attached and emotionally and energetically attached to you know people and things within this world to ways of being that it, it can kind of hinder us from growing whether it's from meeting new people or even you know like i said growing out of a grab growing out of a mindset and former mindset you know that doesn't serve us anymore or that you know just maybe it didn't hurt us but it just was hindering us or you know keeping us stagnant and uh i just kind of wanted to bring a video on expectations and attachment because those two play heavily into each other you know and i've been dealing with that you know not only in my life but on minute things like making content and YouTube and you know I, I have a lot of trouble when it comes to making videos because of the storage on my phone and it either you know won't fully record my videos or it will cut them out halfway through or it won't let me at all or it just won't upload them and you know on top of my expectations for myself to you know be able to upload and bring content and help people I I become very attached to to my videos that I have made, you know, instead of just trusting the universe and letting it flow, I've become, you know, attached to the vi the videos I have made and, you know, I, I don't want to delete them because I don't have room, but at the same time, you know, I have already uploaded them and they're already out here for the world, you know, a lot of what I'm saying, you know, it it can be removed due to what I'm saying. I'm speaking on a lot of the shit that's going on in the Matrix. You know, the, the 5G being a cover-up for the coronavirus and all this bullshit. The coronavirus just, you know, being a man-made a man-made virus that is here to literally just get the new vaccines to us. You know, it is, it's pushing 5G out. It's got us all on lockdown. So they're able to put up all these 5G towers and do what they want without us really knowing as much. And they're going to bring out their new vaccines with who knows what the, what's in them, you know? And the vaccine's gonna be for the coronavirus when in reality it's all just a big fucking setup, a, a big stage, you know? The world's a stage and th this, this, this world is rigged, this matrix is rigged by the ones running it, you know? They're running it to keep us in fear and that's what they're doing. Sorry, a little off topic, you know, back to expectations and attachments, you know, so I, I, I've become pretty attached to a lot of the videos I've made, you know, they, they may not be the best quality or get a lot of views or whatever, you know, I'm not here for that. I'm, I'm here to spread my message. And, you know, I, I can't even keep my videos in a sense, you know, if they were to get removed, they would be gone. But I'm still doing my part to, to, to spread the message and to help people, you know, so so my attachment to my old videos and to what I've already uploaded, you know, whether it gets deleted or not, it, it doesn't matter. You know, what matters is I keep my energy that I have now and I keep, I keep with it. You know, no matter if they remove videos or, or remove my channel, I'm going to make a new one and I'm going to keep speaking my mind. I'm going to keep putting this truth out there because this is what people need to know. People need to know what's going on and people need to know that we have the control of ourselves and of this, of what we manifest in this world. You know, we don't have to be governed by religions and societies and fear, which all of these things govern us by fear. We can simply live in love and live in peace, you know. And so expectations in a sense, I, I've put a lot of expectations on myself when it comes to making content and just being fluent, whether it's like making constant content or just taking breaks i set all sorts of all over the place expectations on myself you know i i my mind can get me out of nowhere and it can just start laying out random weird expectations that in a sense i don't even agree with you know i take some time to be with my family and to live my life and to just keep on my path you know i don't have to make videos every day it, it would be more helpful but you know sometimes i'm 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 with my fiance, we're having, we're having days and, you know, I, I don't need to make videos. I need to live my life and I need to make sure that I'm living my life right and 
creating a healthy manifestation for my family. You know, and this isn't my life. This is a part of my life. And this is, this is me trying to reach out to other lives outside of my family and help, you know. And whether people choose to listen or not or to perceive it good or bad, you know, that, that's on them. I'm just here to speak the message. I'm here to be me. And, you know, I, I, I can't be setting all these expectations on myself and I can't have all this, all this attachment to old stuff that, in a sense, it's hindering me from making new content because my phone's full of old videos that, you know, I don't want to delete because I'm attached to them. You know, I need to let go. I need to trust. And I just, I know I put that out there. So thank you all so much for listening and watching. If you'd like to see more content like this, please like, subscribe, and thank you again.